Hello, I'm Chris Edmonds of the Purposeful Culture Group. Here's today's culture leadership charge for your thoughtful consideration. How prevalent is fear in your workplace? Fear is an involuntary reaction prompted by a stressful stimulus. Old science there. When we see a bear up here in our Rocky Mountain neighborhood, which happened last Thursday, our hearts race, our breathing gets faster, our muscles tense up, our bodies and brains initiate a fight or flight response trying to ensure our survival. Fear generates a similar reaction at work. We tense up, our heart races, our breathing speeds up. We're in survival mode. We can't be cooperative, supportive, or creative when we're convinced we're in danger of being ridiculed, of being blamed, of making mistakes, or of failing. Gary Ridge, president and CEO of the WD-40 company, has this figured out. When he was promoted to lead the company 20 years ago, he knew that global growth was key to sustaining the business. He and his executive team realized that global growth demanded a work culture based on values, fun, and cooperation across their team. In a recent conversation with Gary and a client's executive team, Gary explained that real traction towards their desired culture didn't come about until they removed fear from their workplace. He said, we had to drive out fear and replace it with learning. At WD-40 Company, people don't make mistakes. They have learning moments. Now, Gary defines learning moments as positive or negative outcomes of any situation that need to be openly and freely shared to benefit all. Gary says that's not fear anymore. Sharing learning moments is celebrated. The first thing leaders, or coaches as they're known in their tribal culture, ask when they hear someone sharing a negative learning moment is, how did you interpret our values that got you to that negative learning moment? Key question. But as long as people use their values in their decision making, the learning moment won't be catastrophic to the business or to the customer. For many leaders around the globe, fear is their primary methodology for getting things done through others. The bottom line is that fear doesn't inspire. Learning moments founded on company values inspire. So follow Gary's lead. What have I missed? What questions do you have? Add your thoughts or post your questions below or head to my YouTube channel and do the same.